Greetings WordPressers, Jackson here. Welcome to the channel. Nice to have you as always. So seven years ago, I made a video about transferring, migrating your website from one place to another place. Did pretty well, over 350,000 views, uh, thank you. Followed that up a few years later when I swapped tools for that job. Uh, and then a few years after that, probably about, I don't know, two, three years ago, I swapped to a different plugin for migrating websites. One little caveat, the tool I currently use, it can't migrate from a local dev environment to a, a server. It's strictly only server to server, which is, you know, okay. But my goodness, my goodness gracious me, is this little puppy a demon when it comes to migration? I can't tell you how easy it is to use, how little setup there is, and just how darn quick it does things. And also, ever since I've been using it, I don't recall it ever failing, which is pretty phenomenal. And it can do little weenie sites, it can do medium sites, and it can do huge sites. So what is this plugin? Well, it is the mighty, ferocious Migrate Guru. And in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use Migrate Guru and how to transfer migrate your website from one server to another in way less than 10 minutes. Righty ho, let's get migrating. We're going to migrate my site as it happens to a completely blank vanilla install of WordPress called My Target Site. Let's jump in the back end. First things first, we need to install the plugins on the both the, start, the starting site and the destination site. Let's go search for Migrate Guru, install that and activate. Same thing on the destination site. Add new plugin, Migrate Guru, install that, activate that. There's the target site, there's the starting site. Let's go to if you don't see the splash page like we have on the target site, let's go to the Migrate Guru and we get this the Migrate page. Let's, let's put our email address in because we will get notified of the migration being underway and when it finishes. Very cool. Hit the Migrate button and we'll get a page which shows us to choose a host. Now you don't actually have to do choose a host, but you might be on one of these guys. But my go-to is always going other hosts and using the uh, migrate key. Now the migrate key is actually on the destination, the target site. If you go to the, the splash page there and open up the migration key section, we'll just copy that. We'll go back to our starting site, the site we're migrating, put that in, click migrate, we're underway, believe it or not. It's validating the details, checking servers, checking the connections are open and all that stuff. And once it's finished validating, you're off to the races. And we have, we are, we're, here we go. It's already dumped the, the, the files over. It's now transferring the tables as the database tables. And that's the tables done. I'm going to kind of keep talking, but what I might do is I'll, I might speed things up, but show you exactly how long in you know minutes and seconds this site is going to take now to be fair it's a very small compact site highly optimized as i'm sure you'll understand for one of my sites but already well over halfway through the migration i haven't actually had to speed it up yet maybe i can just keep talking of course if you've got a much bigger site then of course this process will take longer but you can navigate away from here now go make a cup of tea go down the pub if you want it's all doing it all for you in the background because it's using blog vault's very own servers to do all this plus remember you're going to get an email to say when it's done you'll have an email now already saying it's underway when it's done come back to your target site and have a look it does it in its sleep we're on to the final furlong now with the database tables that were exported are now being imported migrated to the destination site the target site but like i said this this will take longer if you've got a bigger site but let me tell you i have used this for um sites that are hundreds of meg in size and i have used this for a site i'm thinking it was in excess of two gig it might have been closer to three gig in size and it never falls over i mean i've literally never had it fail I would point out though, on the destination site, on the target site, turn off all cache, turn off all malware plugins or anything like that. So it's super clean and doesn't have any interference 
with the connection and look we're done i wasn't timing it but i will throw that up on the screen now and that's it so let's go have a look at our site so that was our desk here's our starter site here's our target site a quick hard refresh shirt zam that is it done dusted you've got a live site on your destination target site and everything is just exactly the same extraordinary stuff my great guru couldn't recommend it highly enough well there you go blisteringly fast super easy to set up remarkably reliable and my absolute go-to for server to server migrations the massive migrate guru anyway more info and links in the description but until next time i shall see you later